Hey guys, welcome back to the tune-up. Hebrews 3, 7 says, So as the Holy Spirit says, Today, if you hear his voice and do not harden his hearts, and it, and it goes on from there. Whether you're sizing up a decision, a, a relationship, or a particular circumstance, it can be taxing. When your mind is filled with unlimited options, decision-making can become very confusing. But God's man is devoted fully to God's purposes and will not need a long list of options. Instead, he will target what really matters based on his exposure and experiences with God's purposes. Your filters have changed. For God's man, this means deciding things differently. We make decisions based on God's purposes. And God's way eliminates confusion and, and provides clear decisions and godly instincts for effectiveness. God's man will be driven by the love and character of Christ. A man who risks committing himself fully to these purposes consciously builds his life around them. And he keeps punching and, and will not be mastered by any earthly movement. He might get stunned or knocked down, but, but he will come back punching and landing more blows. Why? Because he sees the most important variables in a given situation. What shows love for God and, and what demonstrates love for people. Extra information is unnecessary because godly instincts are in charge. Instead of making messes, he is discerning without thinking about things that are better around him. Holy hunches and sensing the spirit and trusting insight over eyesight, it sounds spooky to a lot of men because it requires faith and risk. God's spirit is not failing in our lives. Why would we assume differently? The disparity between intuition and impulse lies in our familiarity with his voice if, if we are hearing his voice we cannot give in to our impulses true we have formed habits in in our past life our father understands this and, and he promises to work with us through the firm but compassionate voice of his holy spirit but the question is are you willing to listen Hopefully this gives you thinking, and till next time, may God bless.